thank everyone for joining us at this year's annual Christmas luncheon for both the Regional Loan Corporation as well as Business Resource Capital. We do have one piece of business from, I guess, the middle of the year that we did not conduct. So if I could ask for about a minute or two of your time, I'd like to ask Mr. Bill Pope, our ex officio. I say that, but every day I talk to him, so he's still, <laughs> still with the corporation. And then I'd like to get Mr. Herb Bloom up uh, for a second, sir. Fair speech. Uh, <laughs> I do have to tell you, your eye is in Herb, and there are a lot of conversations that are taken for a long, long time, many, many years. So uh, uh, I was very pleased when he agreed uh, to be president of Regional Loan Corporation for two years. Uh, not only was he a great leader of the board, but I could always call him and bounce things off of him, and he was very free with his time and got a lot of positive advice. And so, just as a small, small token of our appreciation, we'd like to issue her this plaque, which says, to Herbert L. Bloom. Thank God. And he yells for what? <laughs> and I won't tell you what his nickname is in Morgan City either, so it's tough for him to decide to tell you that. But in grateful appreciation for his dedicated service as president of Regional Home Corporation from 2012 to 2014. We recruited him to the board of business resource capital right after his resignation from the RLC board. So we appreciate the assistance from there. Again, I think most of you have known uh, or know that you know we have been around for over 35 years, uh, starting with Regional Loan Corporation and then with Business Resource Capital. And we've committed ourselves to business development activities in the, in the area, um, helping businesses get started, expanding existing businesses, uh, as well as allowing them to grow um, to be larger companies out there. I think if you remember the handout, I think there was over $300 million worth of collaboration that we've done um, with the various partners out there for activities with, with, within the parish and the local community over those 35 plus years. So we're very proud of what we've been able to do. We certainly hope um, that we would be able to continue for the next 35 years and be able to put those same kind of numbers out there. But I can tell you, we wouldn't have been able to do or accomplish any of it without the help of our strategic partners, and that's all of you sitting in this room whether you're a shareholder, a board member, a banker that provides participations with us, the SBA, EDA, city and state officials that provided revenues and stream of income for us, um, you are really what makes it happen. You and, uh, and the staff of RLC um, are the tremendous people that make everything tick for us and we certainly are appreciative of that. If I could ask just for another moment of your time, I would like to introduce the staff, although they hate when we do this, <laughs> um, but the staff members are, again, they're a key to everything we do. So uh, I do have titles for everybody, uh, I think. So if I could, uh, Juan Cajina, I think most of you know, he is one of our seasoned loan officers out there and does a tremendous job for us. Uh, next, we have Ding Lee who is the manager of the BRC program and also a loan officer. We kind of share duties out there. Um, we got John Brown Mejia, who is our loan specialist and doc person. Although I think I found another name. When we moved from Camp Street to Canal Street, I don't know how we would have got any of it done without John being there, purging files, destroying stuff, packing stuff. Uh, all I know is I was afraid to come in one day and find myself packed up. You know? <laughs> so she did a tremendous job for us. Um, we got Karen Matthews, who is our in-house CPA, as well as our director of finance, who keeps me straight from me writing checks and doing the wrong thing all the time. Again, PK Roa is our senior commercial lender out there. Um, and then we have Gail. Now, Gail, I'm really not sure of her title. Uh, sometimes it's administrative assistant, sometimes it's historian. I think the best title Bill gave her years ago is she's Queenie. So and that kind of stays and if you need to know something about the organization or what to do or what not to do, that's the go-to person for all of us. So again, the staff is coming to
I think last is I would just again like to thank you for all the hard work you put in to helping small business, helping us at both the organizations RLC and BRC, and I'd like to wish you and your families a very, very Merry Christmas and a happy and healthy holiday. So with that, we will end it and enjoy your meal. Thank you very much for being here.